made it. After almost 10 years, there's just so much to say. It's now been a decade since I laid my eyes on you. It was high school, and you were sweet 16 and already a goddess. <laughs> I remember I always tried to be fly whenever you walked by. <laughs> but you never said hi. <laughs> then I remember thinking, it's because I'm not a cool guy. Stop trying to be someone you're not supposed to be. Stop living a lie. A year went by and you were always the apple of my eye. But my insecurities as a teenage kid told me to tell the world goodbye. Life led me to a tragedy called the teenage anxiety. The demons of depression had always denied me my self-expression. And the bullies were always keen to lower my self-esteem. But then that's when you came along and we connected and your heart told me to hold on. You became my phoenix that rose from the ashes of darkness and sorrow. You helped me look towards the light and to the brightness of tomorrow. You told me that whenever I should succeed or crumble, I should always remain strong and humble. You became my guardian angel that told me that the sky is the limit as long as I had the courage to go out there and pursue it. You see me grow from a boy to your man. And now I'm honored to see you transform from my dream to my queen. A teenage girl and her soon to be. A simple trip for as they could see. The sky was clear and the hour serene But did they know what the night would bring? Lonely hearts strewn across the land They'd been waiting long for a healing hand My heart was there and I felt the chill When love came down and the earth stood still When love came down and the earth stood still You're both kind, respectful, very dutiful to your families, extremely hardworking, and most of all, you care deeply about each other. And I have no doubt you'll bring a lot of happiness to each other to you grey and old. Shepherd stood on the stormy skies. And you just said to me, Mum, without you, I don't know what will I be. Actually, to me, I would say the same thing to you. Without you and Michelle, I don't know how how I can hang on, you know, till now. So the first thing, I work and I first met at a daycare center in Ashford. Um, the reason why we bonded apparently, according to our parents, if you ask them later tonight, is because we only communicated in grunts and noises. Warwick would always help Jennifer carry her sports bag and even on her birthday, he, he got her a couple soft toy when they weren't even dating. I kept asking my sister, is, is this guy into you? Because I'm pretty sure he is. And she's, she would always say, no, we're just friends.
been a decade since I laid my eyes on you. And as long as you're here, I'll never be blue. I don't think you truly know just how amazing you are. You're my queen. You're my angel. You're my life. And now I'm finally honored to call you my wife.